Hey everyone, it's Will from Blur here. In today's video tutorial, you'll learn how to add existing accounts to your Blur password manager. There's a couple ways to do this, but in this video, we're covering how to add existing accounts to Blur using the Blur desktop browser extension on a third-party website. To learn how to add existing accounts to your Blur password manager using the Blur web app, check out this other video. To begin, be sure that you have the Blur desktop browser extension installed in your desktop internet browser. Check to see if you have the extension installed by looking for the Blur icon in your browser toolbar. As you can see here, I'm reaching the login screen for my Best Buy account. I already have a Best Buy account, but I don't have this account yet stored in Blur, so Blur doesn't know to autofill this form for me yet. All I have to do is manually sign in to Best Buy once, and then look for the Blur pop-up option to save this account. Once I've signed in, all I have to do is look for the Blur pop-up asking me if I want to save this account. Click Save this account to continue. Now that this account is saved, I can always view this account from inside my Blur dashboard. Now, the next time I go to log into Best Buy, I'll see a Blur pop-up panel, and I can easily log into Best Buy with one click. That's all we have time for today. Reach out to us via email at blur-support at getavine.com if you have any questions or any suggestions for our next video tutorial. Thanks for watching.